Our next recipient is known as the godfather of turkey hunting in Massachusetts. His turkey hunting career includes three decades as a spokesman for Quaker Boy Turkey Calls. And he played a prominent role in getting the wild turkey recognized as the state's official wild game bird. His efforts also helped establish more public land for hunting. With Quaker Boy, he conducts seminars demonstrating how to use turkey calls, and he is constantly promoting the sport. We'd like to congratulate 2013 Roger Latham Award winner, JoJo. Members of the uh, NWTF, volunteers, officers, friends all, and the board of directors of the NWTF, and my fellow Roger Latham Award winners, thank you so much. I'm humbled to be here tonight to accept this award and to share the stage with the Massachusetts State Chapter, who we were seeing a little bit earlier, uh, sorry, a little bit later, uh, a small chapter who has done great work. Um, yeah, I'd be remiss if I didn't take a moment to think for a second about some of the people who've helped me along the way, and there have been two individuals in particular who uh, gave me great assistance in those early years in Massachusetts, which you know, we didn't even know what a turkey sounded like, even though we might think that we should. It seems like we are at the Pilgrim State, Thanksgiving and all that. Ernie Calentrelli from Quaker Boy Game Calls gave me an opportunity that I'll never be able to repay him for when I joined that staff, and he started teaching me some of the ins and outs of what it meant to be only a volunteer, but also a better turkey hunter. And Dick Kirby, who took me under his wing in the 80s and gave me chances that I would have never had otherwise. I was learning more about the sport and something I'll never be able to repay. I start with his son today, and Ernie, and um, thank them again for all that they've done for me. I will continue to be a member of this organization forever in Massachusetts. Basically, this has become the greatest conservation success story in the history of our state. And I'm so happy and humbled, sincerely humbled, to be a part of that and to be here tonight to accept this honor. Thank you all so much. This is the last, but certainly not the least, of our Latham Award winners. And this recipient.